Hey guys, it's me, Avenida Fashionista, here to talk to you about something new. It's me, Avenida Fashionista, here to talk to you about something cool. Maybe it's hair, maybe it's makeup, yeah. Maybe it's learning how to love who you are. Let's get started. Hi guys, so today's topic is makeup, so I'll be doing a face of the day, a bright and fun face of the day. So let's get into it. If you like a new background, a new setup, please let me know. I have some draping going on, draping going on here, and so I just wanted to show that to you. I do have a white wall back there. So, um, yeah, and I have the light in front of me, so it's nice and bright. So this is the shirt that I'm wearing. This side, it has the writing in the blue, and it has on the letters blue. So I did the green look, but I wanted to have some kind of blue in there. I did not break the chair, don't worry. It just makes sound. Anytime, anyway, I set the baby on here, and we made it sound. So, yeah, uh, okay. Um, for this look, I, um, I did a, um... Very bright green color on the lid here, and then I did a pop of blue on the uh, inner V right there, and then in the outer V right there, and in the crease, I did a brown, and then I put my brow color, and then I just put regular um, baby wing eyeliner, and I put on my pink lipstick. So I'm gonna show you the products I use to create this fierce look right here, right here, right here, yo, right here. <laughs> Okay, I don't like that it's too low, but I don't like it's too high, so I keep moving it, so I get it, so I get it to perfection. Okay, so I use two palettes to create the look. I use the BH Potty Girl, I use the BH Potty Girl, and I use the um, BH Cosmetics Potty Girl, and the BH Cosmetics uh, 15 Color Pro Palette that you pick up your own color so you won't have the exact same palette as me but with this you can have the exact same palette and I'll use the majority of the colors from this palette so let's get started so I use this color here swatch 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 which is a gold color which is a gold color along with this color here which is a vanilla color if you can see that it's a vanilla color and then that's the gold one and I mix them together always. Sorry, I mix them together always and I put them on my brow bone. And they create a beautiful, beautiful highlight color. Okay, so I put this color in my in inner V after I put in this color, which is not in this palette because this color has deeper greens on the bottom. So, but there. I put the um the deep the bright green but here I put the blue so I just popped it right in there um and then the brown I used to uh soften it right up there I used this deep brown and I used some other colors to uh underneath it to trans trans as a transition color to soften it I used to record on my iPad so when on the iPad I use the front camera so everything is exactly exact mirror. But this is like the other way around. So I think I'm gonna turn this way, I need to turn this way. Uh something like that. <laughs> okay. So yeah, it's a little difficult, but I really like the setup. I have a, I have my own little studio area. So I really um you know, I really like that. So and I like the lighting and it feels very fresh and light for summer. So um, I'm willing to sacrifice the weirdness for the studio area. I mean, for this whole thing. So, this is my palette. Um, now, this palette is custom, so no one person will have the same palette. You can pick out, out of a bunch of different colors, whichever ones you want. I'm a type of girl who likes to pop a bright color here and put a nude color here and then put a light color there. And then maybe pop something in the inner V right there or pop something underneath. And so that's why I did these all bright colors down there and then some other bright colors here. And I did the neutral colors in the middle to go in my crease. That's kind of how I do it, okay? So, um, I use this color here. It's pretty much my skin tone. 
and swatch three different colors on that one finger. Let me use a different finger, you know? <laughs> okay, this color is basically my skin tone. You can see. Yeah. It's basically my skin tone, but I use it to help blend out the colors. So you saw how deep the brown was, but you couldn't tell because I blended the brown out with that a uh, transition color underneath. So you see it really softens it since I did have such a bright pop of color in my lid. Okay, so let's move on to the um, lid color, which is this green here. You cannot miss it. Okay, so I thought, because, okay, it's just weird. Okay, anyway, <laughs> you cannot miss this green color. It is so pretty. So I'm going to swatch that for you. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And so I just put that all over my eyelid with a shader brush from e.l.f. Um, but currently I'm using my fingers. Still work. <laughs> and yeah, those are the colors I use. This color is just so beautiful. It's so um, just radiant. Just swatched it here on my hand. See, it's so pretty. So. Yeah, and that's the color. Those are the colors I used to create this look. Um, I did use um, black eyeliner from Palladio. I, I have to tell you guys about this. I think I showed you guys this in a haul before. It's always haul. Okay. I so showed you guys this before in a Sally's haul. And I've been using it down to a nub. Well, it's not a nub yet, but it's really, really short. I love it. It's so soft. It reminds me of the um, Urban Decay. Okay, I'm hold it against the orange background. That doesn't really help. It's probably better to hold it against the green. See how little it is. That's all I'm to show you how little it is. Okay, so I bought this. I, this compares to the Urban Decay. Um, um eyeliner in zero because it's so soft and so easy to apply so i love this stuff and i just went all the way around and did a baby liner and i did underneath too so yeah and i do like a pretty thin liner I, I just think eyeliner just pops you know pops the look and uh for lips for the lily lily lips i did um politely pink from mac you can see that very pretty color <laughs> and then I took um, Viva Glam Nikki, which I didn't intentionally buy. I'm not going to say nothing about the salesperson who put this in my bag. Uh, not gave it to me. I bought it, but I asked for a different color and she gave me this one when I got home. I was upset. But anyway, um, and I used like, a gift card to purchase it, so then I got kept receipt. Should have, right? I usually do. But, okay. And I just put this on top. I already love it now. Okay, so it's a really, really pretty fun, bright, and playful look. I think it's very playful. I feel like I'm just going to be like, hee, 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 ha, 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 hee, 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 And I like a really pretty light peach blush. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it's really light. Uh, light peach blush on my um, apples on my cheeks. And I did contour. It's been all day, so you probably can't see it anymore, but I did contour earlier today. Um, yeah, I'm going to do the foundation routine video, so stay tuned for that. So, yeah, that is this fun and bright uh, face of the day. I'll give you another glance. <laughs> okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will talk to you all later don't forget to rate comment and subscribe